Hi guys, we're on set today and look who's here. Hi guys, how are you today? So as you can see here, we're here with all these shades of the Sephora lip stain. So many shades, so little time. Keep watching because we're going to show you all the trends over the years and you're going to love it. The lip stains were created in 2011. Did you know that? Well, yeah. And the best thing about it, I know in 2011, the trend was... Red matte lipsticks. Yes. So I'm going to give it a shot. Go ahead. So I'm going to put this on. Let's see if we can do it without a mirror. Do you think that's a good idea? Okay, go, I'll guide you. Okay. <laughs> Girl power. Yeah. Okay, wait. No, let's slowly, go slowly. Okay. I did, I think I ate the lipstick. <laughs> okay, I think, you know, take the mirror, because I can't guide you anymore. Thank it's, you. It's really, not gonna okay. Oh, I think I did a pretty good job now. Yeah. Okay. Seriously, yeah. Let's do this. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Mm. Nice, I like that one. So guys, did you know that Sephora lip stain shade number one is the best seller red color? Oh like, my God, I wouldn't be surprised. Look how pretty this is. It is, like I think it suits every skin tone. Yeah, it's it really so does. Nice. And it complements your smile. So if I wear this, I'll just be smiling all day. Like, seriously, yeah, seriously, it works with the teeth. It's so cute. Oh my God, I feel like I want to try it on. Do you want to? No, I think we I'm have another go, shade. I'm gonna go for another shade now. Let's go for it. Yeah. Okay. Actually, yeah. 2014 was the first time I came to Dubai and I visited Sephora and I got my hands on this lipstick and the purple one. No way. Yeah. What do you think? Love it. Yeah? Seriously. Okay, so let's move on to the next trend. Mm -hmm. Okay, so in 2015, the trend was big lips or contoured lips. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to teach you a trick how to contour your lips without a lip liner. So basically, I'll be using this shade, which is 39, and I'll use a lighter shade. Let's see. I think I you should think? go for this one. Yes, right. It's very they light, yeah. and they match. So this is 40 and 39. I'll contour my lips with the darker there one. There you go. I love how you came up with that idea. It's nice. Like, it's, it's really easy. The applicator yeah. is really easy to use as a lip liner, so you don't need a lip liner. I learned something new today. Mm. <laughs> Okay, so I applied the, the ones for that, mm -hmm. for outlining my lips. Now we're gonna go with the lighter one. So nice, it gives you yeah. kind of like an ombre look. Yeah. Love it. And I'll just smudge it. It's nice actually. I love it. It actually gives the illusion of bigger lips. It really does. And you didn't even use a lip liner, that's insane. True. Hi guys, we're on set today and look who's Hi. here. <laughs> Diana Samatni. Gina. <laughs> Gina, Gina, Gina. Okay, so now we're gonna look back at 2017. Yay! <laughs> okay, so in 2017, monochromatic looks were trending. So I'm gonna pick out a shade that matches my cheeks and my eyeshadow. Shade 84. Yeah. Should we give this a shot? Go ahead. Let's yeah. do it. I really like matching the full look. I feel like it just looks so subtle and pretty. I think we pulled off the monochromatic look in such a good way. Yeah. And I can't stop thinking about how this lipstick is so perfect because you don't even need lip liner. Definitely. Like Seriously. It's epic. And guys, let me give you a small tip on this. So basically, you can save money by using the same lipstick as eyeshadow and blush. It's oh. so easy and it'll give you the monochromatic look, by the way. That is so brilliant. Yes. I love it. Moving on to the next trend, which is 2019, Yay. and it was the no makeup makeup look. Mm -hmm. I think that's the best thing you can ever do. So you can pick a very subtle lipstick. I'm gonna go for 13, and I'll try it Here on. Here you go. It looks so nude and pinkish, like it's so similar to the lip color, like natural lip color. So let's see. Oh yeah. Show see? me. I it love it. It matches my lip color, like you it can't really tell does. the difference. I love it. And now, our final trend is 
our ultimate favorites from everything we tried on so far. Okay. So you go first. Okay. Okay, so I think the burgundy one because it was a bit something out of my comfort zone. Yeah. And it's something I've chosen. Mm -hmm. Very dark, very edgy. Mm -hmm. So I think I'll go for the burgundy one. 99. Amazing. And for you? Honestly, it's a tough choice because I love them all. But I have to say that... You have to choose one. Exactly. So if it comes down to one, I would choose the matte red lipstick number zero one because it just made me feel so confident. Yeah. Heck, it's like yeah. a statement. Yeah. And yeah. Okay. Okay, guys. So these are our favorite shades of Sephora Collection lip stains. And... And let us know which one is your favorite shade in the comment section down below. And now, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for watching. And happy 10 years anniversary lip stain. Happy, happy birthday, birthday cream lip stain. Sephora, the unlimited power of beauty.